The Healthcare Equality Index, or HEI, is a healthcare survey. It is jointly administered by the Human Rights Campaign, which is the largest LGBT rights organization in the U.S., uh, in conjunction with the Gay and Lesbian, Gay and Lesbian Medical Association, or GLAMA. What the goal of the um, Human Rights Campaign and GLAMA's HEI survey is, is to ensure that um, all LGBT individuals um, receive equal and fair access to health care in the U.S. There's a number of areas that are surveyed. One of the areas is uh, uh, how employees are trained in order to uh, uh, treat LGBT patients with uh, respect and dignity, how to appreciate uh, the cultural differences represented within that community. Uh, another thing that's assessed is our uh, quality of our overall employment policies, uh, particularly from a uh, perspective of cultural diversity and inclusion. Uh, patient care policies for members of the LGBT community, patient access. We're very honored to receive the recognition from the Human Rights Campaign. Uh, and Illinois Masonic has been recognized as uh, one of only three hospitals in Metro Chicago uh, to have excelled in the responses on all dimensions of the survey. Our designation as a leader in L LGBT healthcare um, through the Healthcare Equality Index is very important for Illinois Masonic and very important for our LGBT patients. Um, it means that they know that this is a place where they can come and be treated fairly without um, any fears that um, their health care needs are going to be marginalized or that they're going to be discriminated against. Furthermore, it also means that this is a place where their families can be respected. Yeah. We've had a very wonderful uh, partnership most recently with the uh, Joint Commission as a result of Illinois Masonic's previous work in this area. The Joint Commission has approached us to learn more about uh, our practices here and uh, have discussion with us about how our practices can help them shape new standards that might be applicable elsewhere around the country. One of my patients who is transgender, um, she was born biologically male but she's transitioning to becoming a woman and she needed to be hospitalized and before the hospitalization she was very concerned about how she would be treated at our hospital. But from the minute she came in through the emergency room um, up through the minute she was discharged and also when she got her aftercare here at our office, um, she's been extremely pleased with the care she's gotten from everybody. Um, what she and her partner commented on was from the time she got into the ER, again through the time she was discharged and also in our office, that everybody always used the right pronouns without hesitating or, or asking. So they knew that she uh, identified as a woman, um, used the proper pronouns, and also used her chosen female name. And she said that um, she couldn't describe to us how happy that made her feel. That